Hi everyone. In this tutorial, I will show you how to create a pop-up effect. Look like we have many photos and arrange it to a real person. How can we do that? Let's begin. This is a full image of our girl. I've already opened it and move it to the next tab. We go to edit, free transform. And we scale it a little bit smaller. Enter. Next, we create a new white shape. Go to Layer, New, Layer via Copy. I change different color in this new copy shape. Press, Ctrl or Command and T to scale it smaller. And press Enter. Right click on layer 1 and select Duplicate Layer. Move our new layer copy on top of this board. Right click and select Create Clipping Mask. If I hide layer 1, you could see we only have a photo on the table. Select both shapes and move it around like this. Now I can see some parts of the image appear in our photo. It's very nice. Isn't it? Press Ctrl or Command and T. I rotate the photo like this. Rename our layers. I put three layers in a new group and name it number 01. Select group and create drop shadow effect. Right click on group 01 and select duplicate group. Name it number 02. Rename all layers. Select both shapes, so we can move and rotate our photo. To create a new photo, we must create a new copy group. In this step, it's very easy. To create a new photo, we just copy a new group and move it to its position.
turn off all groups. Select quick selection tool and create selection around girl's arm and camera. Go to Layer, New, Layer via Copy. Now girl's arm has been divided into a new layer. Then move Layer 2 on top. Create Drop Shadow Effect in Layer 2. Next step, we open a new image. Go to File, Open. Select Coffee Cup Image. Move this cup to our tab. Again, we go to File, Open and select Coffee Stain Image. Press Ctrl or Command and T scale it smaller. Blend Mode, Linear Burn. I use Polygonal Lasso Tool and remove unused part of this stain. After we create this selection, I will make a mask for layer 4. Click choose this mask and press, Ctrl or Command and I. Then I next step, I will open a plan image. Press, Ctrl or Command and T scale it bigger and create drop shadow effect for this layer. Now we finish it. Do you like this video? Let's subscribe and follow more videos. Thanks for watching. See you next time.